it's Jasmine and I hope that you all are doing well. If you're new to my channel, welcome. It's good to see you. I am a witchy content creator here on YouTube making all sorts of videos and content about like witchcraft, paganism, folklore, uh, things that I'm interested in. And if you are a returning subscriber, it's so good to see you back. Thank you so much. And let's get into today's video. Well, first of all, I apologize about the mess in my background. Um, that is my futon. I'm here in my home office and I'm doing some reorganizing yet again. And so I have like some pillows there, my Vera Bradley bag. This was filled with uh, ritual supplies from our coven's spring equinox ritual that I'm unpacking. And then that is my uh, coven box that I'm filling stuff in from um, the years of being in the solar cord. This video is going to be about the bone box. Bone box, bone box, bone box, the bone box. Bone box is about 25 American dollars. I'm not really sure if bone box ships worldwide or not. Um, but they definitely ship to the States. Um, it's a box that I first came into contact with through my friend Kat. Kat was one of our guests when we went to the Whispers Estates, uh, which is one of the oldest, most haunted. I like to say occupied. Residential homes in our state of Indiana. And so if you're interested in that, there's a whole series on my channel that you can go watch about the Whispers Estates. And Kat is the one who told me about this. Um, I went over to their house when we were filming their experience video for the Whispers Estate as they were one of the participants in the rituals. And I saw all of these beautiful skulls that they had. And, and if you're anything like me, you love skulls, you love bones, you love oddities, you love all things that are, you know, seemingly to be weird by society or taboo. And so I asked Kat, I was like, where have you gotten like all of these bones? And Kat told me that they subscribe to the bone box and they showed me some of like the skulls that they had, some like cat skulls and rodent skulls. And there was a really good variety and they had a ton of skulls. And so I knew that I needed to check out the bone box. Um, I'm already interested in bones, check. I'm into witchcraft, check. Bones, necromancy, witchcraft, working with the spirits of the dead, be it two or four legged, that's my brand. I will be honest with you, I got this box probably about like a week ago and I've already opened it because I was so excited to see what was in the box. So I won't say this is quite like an unboxing, but we'll call this video like a review. So on the side of the box, it says a monthly subscription box like no other, study, learn and collect. Here's what the top of the box looks like. And then here's this portion. I won't show you some of the other stuff because my address is on here. Um, but when you open the box, I thought this was really nice. It does have like this cute little welcome to the skeleton crew hashtag, which I love this. I, I just love branding. And so I thought that that was like really clever. And then when you open up the box, um, there's a whole bunch of this like paper here. Um, so everything is delivered. Sorry about that. My dogs were going nuts for a second. Um, but there's this paper here. And so everything is delivered very safely, very secured. And I appreciated that as well. Also, I like to save this paper. I feel like it makes for like good gift wrap. Um, for like presents or you can like rip pieces of this off and like use it as parchment paper for spells or other things. This is the contents of the box. The box was pretty light this month. Um, I talked to Kat though and it appears like not everyone gets the same items every single month. Um, you know, Kat got different items than I did. So like I said, this box is about $25 American. Not sure if it ships 
worldwide or not. You might want to look into that if you're not in the States. Every month you will receive a skull and like an oddity item. So for 25 American dollars, that's pretty, I would say more than fair considering most skulls are going to run you at least 30 to $40 and up typically. So it comes with like this cute little welcome card and the welcome card says, welcome to the skeleton crew. Thank you for subscribing to Bone Box, the world's first and only natural bone subscription box. Our real skulls are carefully prepared using dermicid beetles and sterilized under our signature chemical process. This ensures that you will receive the highest quality of specimens right to your door every single month. Want to show off your new collection? Share your photos with hashtag BoneBox on social media for a chance to win a free one month subscription. This is just the beginning. Use promo code BoneBox21 for 10% off of your order of 25 or more at Skulls Unlimited. Now, I will say I am not being sponsored for this video at all. I completely went out of my way and got this box for myself because my friend Kat had it and I knew that I wanted it. So Bonebox is not sponsoring me to make this video. Bonebox is not paying me to make this video. This is really just a subscription box that I've personally gotten myself and that I thought that some of you witches may be interested in. So I figured I would share. Also, the things in the box do come wrapped in bubble wrap as well, so you do not need to worry about things coming damaged or not being handled with the proper care. There's also a little shoot and share promotion inside of the box, um, and this basically just talks about their uh, contest where if you upload to social media using the hashtag BoneBox, um, then you may be selected to win a one month subscription free box. If you're interested in this box and you want to use the promo code, again, that promo code is uh, BONEBOX21, all capital letters, and that will get you 10% off of your order of 25 or more at Skulls Unlimited. I'll like pause this here in case you want to pause it. I got two items in the box, a skull and an oddity, which is what you're going to get every time you order the box, a skull and an oddity. The oddity that I received, this is a beaver baculum. And I know that like the reflection of my ring light is kind of making this like hard to see, but it's a beaver baculum, which <laughs> this is funny, but like I've always called it a baraculum like barracuda, like baraculum. I don't know what the hell a baraculum is because apparently it's a baculum, um, but I've always called it a baraculum. So if you hear me refer to this as a baraculum again, um, I apologize. I'm just totally illiterate. No, I'm kidding. Um, so baculum. So if you don't know what a baculum is, there is an information card in the box. It's the information card. And the card says, what is a baculum? The baculum is a unique bone found in the penis of most mammals. This bone aids in copulation when mates have only a short encounter and need to perform quickly. The baculum is sometimes referred to as the mountain man's toothpick and can be utilized as a coffee stirrer. The largest baculum in the mammal kingdom the largest baculum in the mammal kingdom belongs to the walrus, which can reach a length of 30 inches. 30 inch penis bone? That's horrifying. But yeah, so here is the beaver baculum. So I already have a uh, bear baculum that a client gave to me, and I have a couple of raccoon baculums. So this is new. I've never had a beaver baculum. And as a witch, I kind of think about correspondences and magical properties and what could this bone be utilized in? And I think about beavers and I think about how they build their houses and dams and how they block, you know, riverways, so to speak. And I think that this could be used really well on like a, a money altar 
or a home and hearth altar to kind of like build up the prosperity. Maybe in like a magic pouch, mojo bag, a Grigri bag of some variety, and like placing this in there with some money associated, protection associated, home and hearth associated herbs and oils and keeping that pouch on your home altar or on a money altar, I think would be one way that I could foresee myself using this beaver vacuum. Also, there's like a little tag here on the bag, which this says that this was $8. So just the baculum alone um, is an $8 item. And then the skull that I received this month with a bone box is a rat skull. This large rat skull was $33. So altogether, this was what, a $39 box item that I got for $25 American? That's really not that bad. Like I said, a lot of skulls tend to be kind of pricey, at least where I'm at. And so $25 getting a skull in an oddity every month is definitely, definitely worth it. It comes with like a little information card about the skull that you receive. And it says, this month, hashtag bone box delivers to you the rat. Rats have gotten a bad reputation over the course of human history. Yet, based on recent studies of rodent behavior, as well as evidence that gerbils, not rats, were the cause of the bubonic plague, it may not be entirely deserved. I don't know about that. That's what this says. Found on every continent on Earth, except for Antarctica, rats live almost anywhere humans dwell. They spend most of their relatively short lives doing three things, foraging, socializing, and mating. The distinguishing feature you will notice on the skull is the teeth. Rats have only one set of teeth for the duration of their entire lives. They possess 12 molars and four open rooted incisors that grow continuously through the rat's life. So inside of this box, there's also this little card here, um, which has a little promo for Skulls Unlimited. And it says the world's leading supplier of osteological specimens providing the finest quality and largest selection of natural bone and replica skulls. Now, everything that you get in the subscription box is natural bones. So that also kind of increases the value of the box because what you're getting in the subscription box are not resin pieces. They are real official actual skulls. Um, but I do believe on the website you can also get resin versions of these skulls, as well as some other items as well. The rat. The term rat applies to the larger members of the Marade family, compromised of 1,138 species of rats, mice, hamsters, moles, lemmings, and gerbils. Rats, like all rodents, have ever-growing incisors and therefore must chew on wood or other materials to wear them down. This along with their appreciation for human food and crops. The spread of disease causes the rat to be one of humanity's worst pests. Various species of rats can be found around the world. I'm not gonna take this out of the baggie, but here is the rat skull. Can see its cute little teeth. It's adorable. So I can think of a few ways how a rat skull could be used in witchcraft. Um, obviously you can use it for working with the spirit of rat if you feel connected to rat or you want to work with that sort of uh, spirit. Then I think using this on your altar and keeping it on your altar and feeding it could be a way to utilize it. If you have familiars that are rats, this could be a good vessel for that familiar and could be a good way to work with your rat familiar. I also think that you could use this when the car 
Lauren was talking about how rats kind of gnaw away at things. Um, this could be used in some baneful working and gnawing something out or chewing something out or sneaking your way in. I think rats are very clever. And so if you're trying to beguile or manipulate a situation or get further insight or intel, I think the rat skull could be used for that as well. Let me know how you would use a rat skull in witchcraft or a beaver bacula in your witchcraft. Also on the inside of the box, we have their social media tags. And then it also says, follow us online, shoot and share us inside of the box. Overall, I think this box is really, really cute. Um, I'm going to stay subscribed to the bone box at this time. I'm looking forward to see what the next box is going to be. I like this box a lot. Um, the rat skull is an interesting specimen. The beaver baculum is interesting. Um, I am hoping that I will get some larger skulls. Like I would love to have a deer skull or a raccoon skull. Um, I think that would be really cool. I don't know, maybe a fox. I'm not really sure. Um, the rat is cool though. I'm interested in kind of building my skull sort of collection. I have like this old china cabinet that I plan on using to actually display my skulls um, so that way they can be seen. And then some of these specimens I will also be using in spells and things like that so they might not be displayed. But anyway, I would give this box personally, this is a 10 out of 10 for me. Um, Price-wise, it's pretty cheap. Value-wise, it's pretty good. If you're interested in bones, that is, like if, if you want to have some skulls, if you want to do some necromancy, if you want to work with spirits of the land um, and animals and you're a practicing witch, or if you're just a bone collector, if you're interested in that, I think that you could really get a lot out of this box. Um, I'm very happy with the box for what I paid for and I'm going to stay subscribed. Thank you all so much for tuning in. And if you get this box or if you subscribe to get this box, let me know what you think and tell me what skulls that you got. Thank you again to all of my channel supporters um, and subscribers. Make sure to like this video and special shout out to all of my folks on Patreon, keeping me motivated and inspired to continue making videos. I hope that you all have a beautiful night, day, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. And until next time, blessed be.